傳講信息、感恩、心裏感謝神。Now, Pastor Philip will bring us God's message for today. Give thanks with a grateful heart. Happy Thanksgiving, everyone. Come and see, Philo. It's great to hear the testimonies given today. 好高興今日聽到好多嘅見證。I'm sure that there, there were probably more people that wanted to come up. 我相信有更多嘅人樂意嘅同我哋分享。And、uh, it's always wonderful that we we're able to encourage one another and give thanks to God for what He's doing in our lives. 我哋一齊嘅去讚美神，亦都去見證神喺我哋生命裏邊所作嘅功，呢個係一件美事。And especially seeing Him、uh, even through our storms and struggles. 特別就算係喺我哋生命嘅暴風裏邊，我哋睇到佢個工作。Let's bow for the prayer。讓我哋低頭禱告。Father, we thank you for being a wonderful God。天父，我哋多謝你，因為你係一個奇妙嘅神。A God who is above all。你係一個萬有之上嘅主。A God who is worthy of our praise。你係一個配得我哋稱頌嘅神。Worthy of our worship。配得我哋嘅敬拜。Father, for you are our Creator God。天父，你就係我哋嘅創造者，我哋嘅神。And we thank you for you are the one that made us。我哋多謝你，因為係你做我哋。You made us to be your to come to know you。使我哋能夠認識你。And you brought your Son so that we can have forgiveness of sins。亦都藉住你嘅愛子耶穌基督，我哋罪得赦免。And through His death and His resurrection。藉住佢嘅死，佢嘅復活。We too can have life。我哋能夠得著生命。And a restored relationship with you。恢復同你嘅關係。Father, I pray that you will work in our hearts。天父，我哋祈求你喺我哋心裏邊動工。That as we come before you in thanksgiving。當我哋喺感恩節呢一天嚟到你嘅面前。Lord, that you will fill our hearts。求你充滿我哋嘅心。With thankfulness。讓我哋有一個感謝嘅心。You have the joy and gladness。有一個喜樂。That you are our God。去知道你就係我哋嘅神。That we are your children. Lord, fill our hearts with your truths. 主啊，求你亦都让真理填满我哋嘅心。Open our ears and hearts to hear your word. 打开我哋嘅耳朵，我哋嘅心，让我哋听到你嘅话语。In Jesus' name, we pray. 奉耶稣嘅名字祈求。Amen. Amen. Today's passage is probably very familiar to all of you. 今日嘅经文可能好多人都好熟悉啦。You probably heard it many times for the call of worship. 可能喺宣召嘅時候，你聽過好多次。And it's a wonderful passage that I love to read. 對於我嚟講，我好中意呢段嘅經文。The psalm shows us、uh, that a heart of thankfulness comes when we first know who God is, and second, know what He has done for us. 呢段詩篇解釋俾我哋聽，我哋點樣先至有個感恩嘅心。首先，我哋要知道神係邊一位，跟住我哋要知道佢嘅作為。I love this song because it invites us to come to worship God. 我喜歡呢篇嘅詩篇，因為呢篇詩篇邀請我哋嚟到敬拜神。And in the beginning, it reminds us of why we are coming. 佢一開始就提醒我哋點解我哋要嚟到啊。We're called to come to make a joyful noise to the to the Lord, all the earth. Serve the Lord with gladness. Come into His presence with singing. Know that the Lord, He is God. 普天下當向耶和華歡呼，你們當樂意侍奉耶和華，當來向他唱歌。你們當曉得耶和華是神。Simple， 好簡單啊。We come because we know that the Lord is God。我哋嚟到，因為我哋知道耶和華是神。And when we come to worship， we come to adore Him。我哋嚟到呢一度係去敬拜佢。To delight Him， to delight in Him as our Almighty God。我哋去喜悦神，我哋喺神里边去知道佢就系呢个全能嘅神。Worship means that we treasure God above all things。意思就系话我哋系爱神比万有之上。You know, John four four twenty three reminds us that we worship in spirit and in truth。约翰福音嘅第四章咁样讲，佢话我哋系以真理同诚实嚟到敬拜嘅。That truth he's talking about is Understanding who God is through His Word. This truth's meaning is that we need to understand God's character. Understanding His nature, His character. We need to understand 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 His character. We need
Piper says we must worship God authentically and treasure him rightly. John Piper 牧師講我哋必須嘅以真誠嚟到敬拜神，亦都要正確嘅去珍惜佢。So we must understand who God is. 所以我哋必須要知道神是誰。And that every time we come before God and worship. 而每一次我哋嚟到神面前去敬拜嘅時候 ，Our hearts will delight and, re- and revere Him for who He is。我哋嘅心會喜悦神，我哋嘅心會敬拜神。We'll talk about His character a little later in the sermon。我哋喺誒一陣間講到會講到神嘅本性。And now we're going to move on to to understand what God has done for us。我哋而家要講到神為我哋所作嘅。The psalmist reminds us here。God is the Creator. God made us. 詩人呢度提醒我哋係神創造我哋嘅。Verse three is that know that the Lord, He is God. It is He who made us, and we are His. We are His people and the sheep of His pasture. 你們當曉得耶和華是神，我們是他做的，也是屬他的。我們是他的民，也是他草場的羊。So we were created to be worshippers. 我哋被創造嘅時候，我哋係要敬拜嘅。One who will be in awe of God。我哋會對神有呢個嘅讚歎。And when we see God and worship Him。當我哋見到神，我哋去敬拜神嘅時候。That gives us the proper perspective in life。就讓我哋喺生命裏邊有一個正確嘅觀點。To understand that we are not the center of the universe。讓我哋知道我哋唔係宇宙嘅中心。That the world doesn't revolve around me。呢一個嘅世界唔係圍住我嚟走。This is God's word。World。呢一個係屬於神嘅世界。He made it。係佢創造。And he's the one in control。而係佢掌管嘅。And having this proper perspective。當我哋有呢個正確嘅睇法嘅時候。Enables us to live life。就容許我哋過活。Joyfully in。Thankfully, 有一個喜樂嘅心、感恩嘅心嚟到過活。The Bible says the heart of thanksgiving begins here. 聖經話一個感恩嘅心就係從呢度開始。Knowing and acknowledging the Lord as God. 當你去認識神，當你去承認神係神。And、God made us for a very specific purpose. 而神係有一個特別嘅原因去創造我哋嘅。Verse three says, "We are His people, the sheep of His pasture." 第三節咁樣講，佢話我們是他的子民，是他草場的羊。We're created to be God's own people. 我哋被造嘅時候係成為神嘅子民。To belong to Him. 屬於神。We're created to be in fellowship with Him. 我哋被創造嘅時候要同神相交。And God desires to be in relationship with each of us. 而神嘅渴慕就係我同我哋每一個人有呢個關係。God says we are His, we belong to Him. 神話我哋係屬於佢嘅。And God des- describes that as a possession. 喺呢度好似係佢個描述係一個擁有。It's not a negative thing that He treats you like an object. 但呢個唔係一個負面嘅意思，好似你係一件物件佢所擁有。But it's a possession that describes great affection, great love. 但係呢個擁有嘅意思係一份大嘅愛。It's described here the analogy of a sheep. 喺呢一度嘅描述就係用羊嚟到解釋。That we are the sheep of His pasture. 我哋係去草場嘅羊。Now we already talked about the sheep a while ago, many times. 我哋以前亦都講好多次，講到羊。And the sheep aren't the smartest animals around. 我哋話羊唔係啲最聰明嘅動物。Why are we compared to like sheep? 我哋點解攞羊嚟同我哋比 ？You know they have no defense at all. 佢哋唔能夠保護自己。They're totally reliant on someone else to protect them. 佢要完全依賴別人嘅保護。Their teeth are flat. 佢哋啲牙咧係直嘅。Nothing to bite. 佢哋咬唔到嘢嘅。And, and this is the picture that, that the psalmist wants us to see. 但係詩人就要我哋睇到呢幅圖畫。And we are the sheep of God's pasture. 我哋係神草場嘅羊。And Isaiah 53:6 says, "All of us like sheep have gone astray. Each of us has turned to his own way. But the Lord has caused the iniquities of us all to fall on Him." 以唱下書五十三章六節咁樣講，我們都如羊走迷，各人偏行己路。耶和華使我們眾人的罪業都歸在他身上。See, we're described as sheep that have gone astray. 
呢度話呢一隻羊係走失咗。And we turned away from God。我哋轉離神。You know, we sinned against Him。我哋犯罪得罪神。And because of that sin, we deserved His wrath and punishment。係因為我哋嘅罪，我哋配得嘅係神嘅憤怒，神嘅。Yet God shows His goodness and His mercy. 但係神點樣彰顯佢嘅美善，佢嘅恩慈咧 ？He continues to show us that love by sending us His Son into the world to die on the cross to pay the penalties of our sins. 佢繼續彰顯對我哋嘅慈愛，就係差派佢嘅愛子耶穌基督喺十字架上為我哋還上罪債。John 10:11 says, "I am the good shepherd. The good shepherd lays down his life for his sheep." 约翰福音十章十一节咁样讲：我是好牧人，好牧人为羊舍命。And it is through that work of Christ on the cross, the good shepherd， 就系藉住主耶稣基督呢个好牧人喺十字架上嘅工作。That brings us forgiveness of sins， 带过我哋使我哋嘅罪能够得到赦免。It restores our relationship to God， 亦都回复我哋同神嘅关系。If we receive Him as our Lord and Savior， 如果我哋接受主耶稣基督为我哋嘅救主。We become part of His kingdom. 我哋就喺神嘅角度有份。There's no greater love than that. 冇一份嘅爱比呢个爱更加嘅大。And we wonder how do we respond to a love like that? 我哋向呢一份嘅爱作一个如何嘅回应咧 ？God loves you. 神爱你。He sent Jesus to be that good shepherd to die for us. 佢就差派主耶稣成为呢个好牧人，为着我哋嘅罪而死。He died and rose again. 佢不但死。And he continues to be that good shepherd to watch over us. He 亦都继续做呢一个嘅好牧人去看顾我哋 ，to lead us through to to eternity. 去带领我哋进入永恒。This is what God has done for us. 呢个就系神为我哋所作。Do you know what God has done for you? 你知唔知道神为你做咗啲乜嘢咧 ？Have you come to know Him as your Lord and His Savior? Your savior. 你你有冇认识到主耶稣基督为你嘅救主咧 ？You know, becoming a Christian actually is only the beginning. 成为个基督徒其实只不过系一个开始。You know, like I reminded us before, God created us to be in relationship and fellowship with Him. 就系等于我头先提醒过大家，神创造我哋嘅时候系。個願意係我哋同佢有相交。So when we become a Christian, it's just the beginning of that intimate relationship that God wants with for with us. 所以如果我哋成為基督徒嘅時候，只不過係喺同神呢個親密嘅關係裏邊嘅開始。And that's the beginning because now we have a restored relationship to God. 點係一個開始，因為我哋同神嘅關係係回復咗。Now we can fellowship with Him face face to face and heart to heart. 現在我哋能夠面對面、心連心嘅咁樣同佢相交。And it's because when we become a Christian, He gives us the Holy Spirit to dwell within us. 係因為當我哋成為基督徒嘅時候，佢咧亦都賜個聖靈居喺我哋嘅心裏邊。And it's the Holy Spirit that actually unites us to Christ. 就係藉住聖靈使我哋與基督聯合。It's the Holy Spirit that binds you to Him. 係聖靈使我哋與。神結連 ，that you are his child， 你係佢嘅兒女 ，the sheep of his pasture， 你係佢草場嘅羊 ，the people of his kingdom， 你係佢國度嘅子民。You know now you are really ready to draw close to me。現在你實在係準備好嘅去靠近我。And now is the time that I desire to be in true fellowship with you。現在你同我能夠實真正嘅嚟到相交。As God the Father。因為我就係你嘅天父，你係我嘅兒女。And knowing God is something that is He desires us to do。而神渴慕嘅就係我哋去認識神。To know Him。認識神。To love Him。愛神。J.I. Packer in his book Knowing God。J.I. Packer 牧師喺佢嗰本書叫做認識神。He says that the study of the nature and character of God is the most practical. Project anyone can engage in. He 咁样讲到，去认识神嘅本性同佢嘅位格，系任何一个人能够做到最实际嘅一个学习。Because knowing God， 因为认识神 ，are crucially important for the living of our lives。认识神对于我哋如何过活系十分之重要。You know we can't. 
live our lives properly without understanding God's character, His attributes, and His nature. 如果我哋唔明白神嘅属性同神嘅位格嘅时候，我哋唔能够正确嘅去过活。And He desires for us to have that intimate relationship with Him. 而佢渴望就系让我哋同佢有呢个亲密嘅关系。Let me let me give you an example. 讓我俾一個嘅例子你。A、marriage is the most intimate human relationship that God has designed for us. 婚姻係神所設計中喺地上最親密嘅一個關係。And、there's no one that is more intimate than one's spouse. 冇一個人比你嘅配偶同你更加嘅親密。And it's a covenant union where God defines two people as becoming one flesh. 呢個就係一個聖喺聖約底下嘅結合。個描述就係二人成為一體。The idea of knowing one another to be one flesh。個意思就係彼此嘅認識到一個地步，二人成為一體。It, it, it defines a deep intimate relationship。呢度所描述嘅就係同你所愛嘅人有一個好親密、好親密嘅關係。You know, when you come to Thanksgiving, yeah, I thank God for the wonderful wife that He's given to me. 冇錯，嚟到感恩節嘅時候，去感謝神，俾咗一個好嘅太太我。And God has given me the wonderful opportunity to love her, to know her deeply. 神俾我有個機會去愛佢，亦都深深嘅認識佢。To understand her character, her personality. 去認識佢嘅性格，佢嘅個性。To understand her likes and dislikes. 去認識到佢喜歡啲乜嘢，唔喜歡啲乜嘢。To know what she desires. 去知道佢渴望啲乜嘢。To understand the things that make her afraid。亦都知道有啲乜嘢佢係怕嘅。You know, especially when you have a wife, the most important thing is to understand how they like things done。如果你有太太嘅，你會知道最緊要你知道佢哋中意點樣做嘢法。You know,、uh, you know, it's important because it awakens wrath and displeasure when you don't know that。因為如果你唔知道嘅時候咧，你就會有好大嘅麻煩啊，佢會嬲嘅。And you have to understand the things that bring her joy. 但係同時你都知道啲乜嘢會帶俾佢喜樂。What are the things that she loves? 佢喜歡啲乜嘢 ？What are the things that she cares for? 有啲乜嘢佢好關心嘅 ？And as a husband, we desire to see the inner beauty that they have. 而我哋做丈夫嘅更加要睇到就係太太嘅內在美。The intimacy of a deep relationship. 喺呢一個親密嘅關係裏邊。You know the amazing thing. This is exactly. How God desires our relationship to Him to be. 但係神渴望我哋同佢嘅關係就係咁樣。Throughout the Bible, God uses this illustration of marriage. 喺聖經裏邊不斷嘅都係用咗婚姻呢個嘅例子。To symbolize Christ in the church. 去描述基督同教會嘅關係。God wants to have an intimate relationship with us. 神要求嘅係同我哋有個親密嘅關係。You know, God doesn't want to be an acquaintance of us。神唔係想同我哋做一個普通朋友。Not that you just believe in Him as Lord and Savior and the the rest is history and He's just a friend。唔係話你信咗主之後咧，其他一切咧就淡忘啦。佢只係好似一個朋友。Once you become a Christian。但係當你成為一個基督徒嘅時候 ，God wants that deep。Intimate relationship with each of us. 神就係要求我哋同佢有個親密嘅關係。That He loves us for who we are. 我哋係點樣嘅，神就係點樣嘅愛我哋。And He's changing us to make us more and more holy each and every day. 而同時佢亦都去改變我哋，讓我哋每一天更加嘅成熟。And He loves you for who you are. 你係點樣嘅，神就係點樣嘅愛你。He sees the beauty and majesty and 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 your glory. 佢亦都睇到你里边嘅美丽，睇到荣耀。Because in reality, you are to reflect Him. 因为事实上你系要去反映佢。And in reality, God wants us to love Him, to know Him, to see our beauty and our glo- His glory. 而神亦都樂意嘅，我哋去認識佢，喺佢裏邊亦都睇到呢一個嘅榮耀。And that's what it means to have a heart of worship。呢個就係有一個敬拜嘅心嘅意思。You know, not something that we just do once a year。唔係我哋淨係一年做一次。But it's a daily thing。但係每一日喺我哋嘅生命裏邊，我哋都會咁樣做。That we have this heart of worship and thanksgiving。我哋有呢一個嘅。
敬拜嘅心，有呢个感恩嘅心。Something that should drive us each and every day of our lives。而就系呢一个嘅心，应该推动我哋每一日嘅生活。That we live each day in intimate relationship to God。我哋每一次日过活嘅时候，系同神有呢个亲密嘅关系。We up, we 我哋每一日起嚟嘅时候，就有呢一个嘅机会去认识神。有呢个机会嘅去研读佢嘅话语，更加深深嘅认识佢。Because God desires to be to know you each and every day。因为神嘅渴慕就系每一天亦都认识你。God lives in our souls through the Holy Spirit. 藉住圣灵，神就系住喺我哋嘅灵里边。So we are communing with Him all the time. 所以我哋时时系与神相交嘅。You know, but it is a relationship that still needs to be nurtured. 但系呢一个嘅关系仲系需要嘅喂养。It's just like any other relationship. 就系等于我哋任何一个关系。God is always seeking our audience. 神不断嘅系等候聆听我哋。But it's always in our busyness of life. 但系喺我哋繁忙嘅生命里边 ，we fail to nurture our relationship to God. 我哋冇去喂养我哋同神嘅关系。Just like a husband can be consumed by things of this world and even work. 等于一个做丈夫嘅，佢可以被佢嘅诶事业嚟到系充满咗佢。Fails to cultivate that intimate relationship with his spouse. 佢就忘记咗点样继续嘅去喂养佢同佢太太嘅关系。And that relationship will deteriorate. 而呢一个嘅关系亦都会去恶化。And in the same way, our relationship to Christ. 亦都同样嘅，我哋同基督嘅关系。It's something that we need to cultivate to to nurture. 一样系要喂养嘅。God is the one that will draw close to us. 神系会靠近我哋嘅。He is moving our hearts closer to Him。佢系打动我哋嘅心，我哋嘅心去靠近佢。But He wants us to worship Him truly from our hearts。佢亦都要我哋真心嘅去敬拜佢。A heart that will love Him and seek after Him。系一个爱慕佢嘅心去寻觅佢嘅心。Packer also says。Packer 牧师亦都咁样讲。Truly knowing God。真正嘅认识神。Is a personal relationship。系同神有一个个人嘅关系。Where you know His attributes。系你认识佢嘅位格。You understand God's character。你知道佢嘅本性。Understand his dislikes and likes。知道神喜欢啲乜，唔喜欢啲乜。Verse five says, "For the Lord is good, and His love endures forever. His faithfulness continues through all generations." 第五节讲，因为耶和华本为善，他的慈爱传到永远。他的信实直到万代。Now do we understand what it means that God is good？ 我哋明明乜嘢叫做神本为善呢 ？How does goodness of God affect the way that you live？ 因为神嘅美善如何影响到你嘅生活呢 ？You know that helps us to understand that everything, everything that God does， 让我哋明白到神所做嘅每一件事 ，is always righteous and good。永远都系公义美善。There's never an intent for evil。喺神里边冇一个恶毒嘅意念头。Never intent for revenge。唔会话要复仇嘅。Never intent to do us harm。唔系要伤害我哋。All that God does。神所做嘅一切。He is good。佢系美善。He is righteous。佢系公义。And God is love。What does it mean that He is love？ 当你要讲到话神系爱嘅时候，嘅意思系乜嘢咧？ God loves us enough to send Jesus to die for us. 神爱我哋到一个地步，差派耶稣为我哋死。And as the good shepherd, he will lay down his life for us. 而因为佢系一个好牧人，佢亦都为我哋牺牲佢嘅生命。And what does it mean that God is faithful? 咁神嘅信实有咩意思咧 ？No matter what happens in our lives. 无论喺我哋生命里边发生咗乜嘢事都好。God will never let us down. 神唔会使我哋跌倒。Okay, we might not get what we want all the time。又或许我哋唔会时时去得到我哋想得到嘅嘢。You know, our life may not always be a rose garden。我哋嘅生命唔会时时喺个玫瑰园里边。Because we we live in a broken world and we face pain。因为我哋我哋系住喺一个破碎嘅世界里边。That faithfulness of God means that He will never forsake us。神嘅信实嘅意思系佢永不把我哋撇下。
You know, we have to understand these natures of God. You know, many times we read Galatians 5.22, this fruit of the Spirit. And we apply it to man. The fruit of the Spirit that we all should have. You know, the fruit of the Spirit is love, joy, peace, patience, kindness, goodness, faithfulness, gentleness, self-control, and against such things there is no law. But this fruit of the Spirit actually describes God perfectly. This fruit of the Spirit, you can, you, can, you can cross that out and say, God is love, joy, peace, patience, kindness, goodness, etc. That the full essence of each of these traits is perfectly exhibited by God all the time. God is forever loving. Joyful, peaceful, and patient. He is the one that is always kind and always good and always faithful. And his dealing with us is always in gentleness. He is always the one that is in self-control and never lashes out in anger for us. And Christ exhibited these without blemish. I was called, called the fruit of the Spirit. And this is the fruit that bear that the Spirit bears in us when we become a Christian. We will bear these fruits as well. Because bearing these fruits is actually becoming more and more in the image of Christ. And, and that's what he is doing. Each and every day he's helping us to be more and more like him. You know, notice the word fruit is singular. You know, the fruit is all these traits. You know, and it's described many ways. You can look at a fruit as a bouquet. They come as a whole. But every, every flower in that bouquet is different. And God will bear the fruit in your life as you grow in relationship to him. See, it's only when we grow close to God that we have a thankful heart. To understand that all that we are, all that we have, it is a gift from God. And a lot of times we have to look at our own hearts. Are, we, are, are our hearts full of thanksgiving. You know, I read a good article by Paul Tripp this week. And he says the universal language of the world is griping and complaining. The universal language of the world is griping and complaining. That we're always complaining about something. We're always griping of the things that we don't have. We're always complaining about how the people do things. But the heart of a Christian 
needs to be a heart of thanksgiving. Are our hearts full of the joy and gladness of Christ? You know, I know that you know, some of you are maybe going through life circumstances that maybe cover over us and take away that thankfulness. You know, it's very easy for the things of this world and the circumstances to kind of drag us down. It's very hard to have a heart of thanksgiving, of joy and gladness when things aren't going good. And that is exactly when we need to go to God. To dwell in Him. To rest in Him. You know, because thankfulness should not come from our circumstances. It comes from God. Knowing what? Knowing that the Lord is God. That we are to dwell in his character, his attributes. Remembering God's goodness. To revel in his power. To reflect upon his faithfulness. To remember his grace and mercy. That has been evident in our lives. These are the times we need to come and to dwell in the love of Christ. To see who he is. To remember what he's done for us. He's given us a love that endures forever. And it's a love that will lead us through to eternity. Because if you are in Christ, you are his chosen people. You are his beloved. And no matter what Things and circumstances you may face in life. Nothing can ever separate you from God's love. The real joy of the Spirit is independent of our circumstances. It's based on our relationship to Christ. So we must remember. In order to have that thankful heart, you must look to Christ. We must cherish and cling to this precious relationship that God has given to us. That you can come before God and cry out, Abba, Father. Lift me up. Let us pray. Father, we come before you. We cry, Abba, Father. For you are a God that truly loves us. Father, we thank you for the blood of Christ. That he suffered and died. In our place. So that we can have forgiveness of sins. We thank you, O Lord. For the grace that you've shown to us. That you are the good shepherd. That you have laid down your life for us. Father, help us to see you for who you are. Lord, help us to understand what it means to live each day with you. To have a heart of worship that comes to you to come to sing with joyful songs. That each and every day we enter your gates with thanksgiving. 
that we give you praise. Father, we thank you for your love. And we pray that you will continue to grow us in your word so that we will desire you above all things. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Amen.